Hey everybody, it's Mickey B. It's time to do, it's, well, I should say, it's way overdue on me doing a haul. I have been purchasing things and I have been setting them aside in anticipation of doing a haul, but I just have not been still long enough to get it done. So tonight I am making an effort because my stack is building up. And I know you guys have been enjoying my Dollar Tree walkthrough. Some of you guys hate the music. Some of you guys want me to talk more. So this is my segment where I do my talking because I can be pretty chatty. And I don't like the whole chatting when I just want to know what's new, which is why I do the walkthroughs on the music so you can just see what's out there. Now, if you want to hear me talk and go on, then this is where I do that. So having said that, let's go ahead and get started because I have a lot of stuff that I've been um, purchasing over the weeks, but I haven't been hauling. So we're gonna jump right into it and we're gonna start off with what I got today was some calendars. This is the first one that I got, that's the front. This is the back. And this is to go in my office because it matches my highlight color in my office, which is pink. I don't know if you can see around me. Maybe I don't have the camera zoomed out enough, but that is like the accent color in my office. This is the other one that I got, the floral design, which I saw this first and I thought, oh, I really like that one. And I also like this one, but then when I was watching my own video back, I thought, I can't believe I didn't get the pink one. That's the color that's in my office, the pink and black. It just fits in there perfectly. So I went back and got this one. So these are the ones, and I'll probably give one of these to my daughter if she wants one, or I'll just exchange it for something else. But I need at least about five calendars. Um, so these are the three uh, notebook style calendars and then for the wall I got the puppy and this is I like these because you get the big one and you get the little one I always get the dogs I'm a dog owner dog lover so dogs always have a special place in my heart these are the different pictures that are on the back of the dog one and then the other one that I got like this the two pack is the tropical beaches and I like to put this one in my office because when you had a long crazy day It'll be, it's always nice to focus on something that's nice and pleasant to escape to. So these are the two that I got and they had a whole lot of different styles of calendars. And if you saw my last walkthrough, uh, August 12th, you'll see a lot of them in there. And even on some of the walkthroughs before that. But those are the calendars that I selected and I like to get them now. And Dollar Tree is smart, get your calendars now so when the first of the year comes you're good you're not running around trying to get the best selection because it'll be gone all right let's move on to the next thing okay the next thing I got are the minions two-in-one snack cups there were six designs in total and I did not obviously take them out of the box but I'll twirl it a little so you can kind of see the design on this one can't twirl it all the way because this part of the back is stopping it but if I turn to the side here, you can see the three different designs that they come in. So this is one of the ones that I got. And this cup, this is the, it's called the Snack Ease Junior. So there's the original one that came out was a, a lot bigger. I think it was 12 ounces versus the eight ounces. And the cup, I think on the big one is six ounces versus the four ounce one. So this is obviously for kids. So that's the first design that I got. The second one is this one. There were six in total at my Dollar Tree that I saw. And here's the lid colors. I think these are the same color lid. Yeah, these are the same. So this is the second style that I got. The third one is this one right here. looking in the viewfinder to make sure I'm giving you a good uh, representation of the cup. Here is the fourth design of the cup. This is a blue lid and blue versus this one. So I guess that's kind of teal and then blue. That's the color of the season apparently. 
two more. This is an orange top. This is the design. It says I, I can't read it. I hung something. It's hard to, and I don't want to pull them out of the packaging and do all of that, but that's the fourth one. And then the last and final one that I got is a red top. And it looks like something like in London, a British type of design or wording. Minion Mania. It says, Hello London. So I don't know if this was something that was introduced over there. But I was at Big Lots today and I saw the exact same cups for $4. Crazy, huh? <laughs> Alright, let's go on to the next thing. Okay, this next thing that I got are these stickers. Now, I generally do not like butterflies, but these things are so beautiful. I actually tried very hard not to buy them. And when I filmed them, when I recorded them for my walkthrough, they had just put them out and I said, these are gonna go fast. So I'm going to let that happen. And if I come back and they still have some, then I'll get some. Well, I went back and they were all sold out like I thought. But then I was in the neighborhood today and I dropped in there and I wasn't really looking for them. And they had them, so they completely restocked. So let me show you the ones that I got because I went ahead and I got all of the ones that they had. And I got two of each one, so let's see. And then they had a new one out that I hadn't seen before. And it's not even on my walkthrough, which was this one. Aren't those beautiful? These are the prettiest, they're the 3D, and they're glittery and shiny and metallic. And again, when I do my arts and craft type stuff, I don't really like butterflies, but these things are just absolutely beautiful. So that's the white and the black. And then they had, try to put them together for you. Oh, they have this purple set right here. And I got two of each one because I doubt I'll probably get another chance to get these again. So here's the purple ones right there. And again, these were all in my walkthrough videos. I got two of those. And my absolute favorite color of all time is pink. So you know I had to get pink. I have little space in which to do this, so I'm a little awkward. So here are the pink ones I got. I really like pink. Pink is my color. Those are so pretty. That's the pink ones. And then they had another set of blue ones, which is this. want to see the difference between the first blue set and the second blue set here it is this one has eight this one has seven and then they had this set right here two of these and I'm really like trying to cut back on shopping at the Dollar Tree, but these, I fought it and I fought it and I made a little extra money today. So I said, you know what, you deserve this. So I got these. And as you see, this is the second set of the black and orange ones, two different designs. And then the last set were the mint green ones, which are also nice. But just beautiful they're gonna any project that you use these on is really going to just stand out so i had to get them i fought it but i had to get them and i recommend if you see them get them right away because they're probably i just got lucky i can't even believe that they put more out and i think the ones that they put out i possibly no i did leave a few but i possibly bought the majority of what they just restocked today and i feel like they did it right when i walked in there so let's move on to the next thing okay now the next thing i got the dollar tree has a way of getting you with all of this cute little stuff oh snap come on how appropriate is that you know i had to get it this is a magnet and it's also a frame it's a magnet frame 
the magnet in the center, the old snap part, and then this part that says selfie is also a little frame and a magnet, and then this bigger part is a frame and a magnet. Isn't that cute? And they had different designs, which are also on my August 12th walkthrough video if you want to see the other ones. And this is the other one that I got, the one that says Believe in the middle. And the Believe is the magnet, and there's one frame, and then there's another frame. And I just love this color scheme. It's so festive, and it just speaks celebration, have fun, let's have a good time. So this color scheme, and it fits right in my office. This one I just got because, oh snap, I mean, how could I not get that? With the camera on it, I mean, that's what, it, that's what I'm doing. So I'm like, this, even if I didn't like it, that old snap got me. So that's why I got that one. But the Believe, the color scheme, the pink, especially the pink, it always, if there's pink in it and it's something cute, that's where they get me. And I'm really trying. I, I need to go into Dollar Tree Rehab right now, but they're getting me with all this pink, cute stuff. And, um, you know, I'm losing this battle right now, but let's move on to the next thing. This next set that I bought, also in my August 12th haul. Now this is the whole set. I actually went and bought all six pieces. One, two, three, four, five, six. And it's all um, the same thing, the same style of stationery. And this is a small book of great ideas. So it's just a little, in fact, I would like to open this just to get an idea of what this one looks like, if I can do this quickly, because I don't want to drag this out too long. But let's just see what it looks like. So there's a little magnet here that keeps it closed. And it's just, it's a small book, just like it says, with some note paper in it that you can close up and seal up and it's the small book of great ideas i always have ideas of different things that i want to do and i want to get to and i have them all over the place on all these different pieces of paper and it drives me crazy because when i go to find the idea i don't know where the piece of paper is that i wrote it on so now i have this small book of great ideas so it was just perfect for me now also in this set are sticky notes or post-it notes with uh, the little regular square size and then they have the little tab size at the bottom and all those rainbow colors but it still matches the set so and this whole set is an organization set called get organized and that um, is that then there's a big book of great ideas which coincides with the small book of great ideas. I just thought that was really cute because I always have great ideas and to have a place to put that's just cute and it's got my little colors in it that I like is wonderful. Now this is lots of things to do to check off list and it's uh, Monday through Sunday just the first letter of the day of the week and you can list the things that you need to take care of on that and then here's a bigger pad that says this week what else is on here notes and ideas and then we've got Monday through Sunday also so just really cute uh, little notepads to help you stay organized and to stay fashionable while being organized and then this is just one long sheet of like a uh, sticky a weekly ooh, excuse me I almost dropped it a weekly sticky note is what it's called and um, yeah, it's kind of interesting the way it's like that. It doesn't really have lines on it, but you know, it's something cute that you could use to have out. I'm in the process of redoing my office space and my craft area, so I'm trying to get things that are going to be sitting out that look nice, neat, and cute and coordinate. So this was perfect, and that's why I went ahead and I bought the whole set, and I really like it. Yes, there's more. I wanted to say on that set, um, that would make a great gift to give someone and they probably wouldn't think you only spent six dollars a dollar for each one of those because it coordinates so well you put that in a nice gift bag with some tissue and a bowl and some ribbons man i'll tell you the dollar tree is really hooking us up the next thing that i got are these mesh laundry bags i got these this is what this one looks like it's blue 
I got a blue one. This is the it color this year. I don't know. It, to me, it looks green. I was going to say green or blue, but actually, I would call this aqua. This is, this is like the it color this summer, aqua. Kind of along the lines of the mermaid stuff that's so popular and in today. And then I got this orange one. I got these because in my extra room, whenever I have guests come into town, they can put their dirty laundry in it if they stay long enough for me to, um, or for the laundry to be washed. Then those are perfect to have. And the ones that I have already are old and torn, so I figured it was time to replace them. And for a buck, actually these are really big. There was one that was open in the store it says it's 36 inches by 24 inches so that's a pretty good size bag and it'll fit a lot of dirty laundry so i got that to replace the old ones that i had and then i got these two this is nothing exciting but i needed some tarps to go over my exercise equipment that's on my patio outside and for a dollar that's a pretty good deal for a dollar for a tarp um, they're not super expensive anyways, but for a dollar for something that's just going to wear and tear in the weather, I think that's a pretty good deal because the other ones that I had, I'm replacing those. And they probably cost about four or five dollars on sale. And I'm still needing to buy new ones for those because, you know, things weather, they get old. So for a buck, I got two and I may go back and get more. So that's a good deal if you need to cover something up outside. And it's four feet by six feet so it's not the biggest size but you can buy more than one for two dollars and get eight by twelve still a good deal <laughs> you didn't think i was done did you i got something else for you remember these cute little fall decorations this is the little owl with the bell owl how do you say that this is the owl or owl and I got to go with him, this pumpkin that says Autumn Greetings. They had other designs and of course, if you look at my, I think that was, this was a 12th, so August 5th, I think in my August 5th walkthrough, you'll see all the other Autumn designs, but I only got these two. This is when I was really in control and I was being disciplined and I spent $2. <laughs> And I just got these two things and I got them to add to a couple of fall decorations that I already have and that's like a little scarecrow girl with a little bell of hay and a pumpkin so I thought that would be a good accompaniment for those I bought these ice trays over the summer and I've had them sitting here probably about three weeks now and I bought them for my niece's daughter because she was, I bought her one of those little um, colored, glass colored uh, bottles that had the straw in it and she really liked it and she was putting ice cubes in the bottle but she was using the big size ice cubes and when I tried to put some in mine, I had to force them in there and I said, how are you getting these ice cubes in this bottle? And she said, I'm running water over the big square ones until it got small enough to fit so i says well i they have some ice cube trays that are small enough that will fit already so i went and bought these so that she could use it use them but i never got around to hauling and now she's gone back home so oh well when she comes back she'll have those um but what i was going to say what i liked about these and whoever may have bought them if you have bought them and used them i feel like this silicone part at the bottom makes them come out really easily so if you bought these and used them let me know if they work really easy like that because that's why i bought them because i felt like they would be really good to get the ice out i got two of these water bottles a blue one and a pink one um very pretty very pretty design and over the summer you know you drink a lot of water so it's always good to have a nice water bottle in the house even though I didn't need any more nothing lasts forever so when the ones that I have break down then I'll have some beautiful replacements what else do we have you guys saw these gems what are they calling these acrylic gems decorative accents I got a red one and I've got two 
bags of these clear ones. I like clear, I like blingy. So anytime I see clear, I'm gonna go for two. These are for my crafting DIY projects that I haven't had time to sit down and do. Oops, I almost dropped these. Um, but yeah, I got two of these and they're really, I have kind of an idea of something to do with them, but I'm never sure until I actually sit down and do it. So that's what that is. I saw this oral care kit and I thought this would be neat to have, especially this little utensil right here. And I know that's something that dentists use when you go get your annual teeth cleaning. Yeah, with this little mirror, and this is a tongue cleaner. I don't really care about the toothbrush, but this instrument I cared about the most because I feel like maybe, you know, carefully, you could learn how to scrape off your own teeth, you know, the flat build up to where it doesn't have to build up, you know, but again, cautiously, carefully, I'm no dentist, I don't wanna mess up anything, but I thought I'd play around with that and that's why I got it. So that way in between my appointments, I can keep my teeth extra clean and that buildup won't happen. These are the other two of these laundry bags that I got, the pink one and the white one. These actually were the first two that I bought and I went back and bought the other three that I showed you earlier because initially the room is like pink, white, pink, white, purple, I think. And um, so I just bought these two, but I'm like, because they're not the strongest, when these two uh, wear down or get holes in it, then I'll have my backups that I showed you earlier. Okay, Janae had told me I was a diva and she said she when she walks into my office, she said, I can't believe it, but you're really a diva. She said, and I said, what makes you say that I'm a diva? I'm like, I'm so far from that, it's not even funny. She says, she says you're a low-key diva by all the stuff you have in your office. And I think this next thing <laughs> is probably some of what she's talking about. Because I'm like, what do, you, what do I buy that makes you feel like I'm a diva? So this little compact, the little blingy bling, is because I like bling and I like pink and shiny and bling. So I think that's why she feels like that. But again, um, if you open it, it has the two mirrors and closes clips closed so i got a blingy one and a pink one so when i sit it on my desk in my office it looks good that's not a diva is it you just want things to look nice i totally don't agree with that whole diva assessment of hers but i think that's one of the things that makes her feel that way now i've got some fashion nails some sassy and chic fashion nails of course you know they're pink I thought these were cute I don't know if they're gonna look too busy on my hand or not this is kind of like an Aztec design a Mayan type design um, the white what is this white uh, red white and black I like the idea of that but I don't know how they'll look all together and this one I really liked again this is that uh, in color kind of aqua, uh, just kind of screams beachy, water type of color. And I think it's really cute. It has like a sailor theme to it with a little nautical uh, anchor on there. So I think these would be cute to you. So I got these three. I don't think I have any more in here. And yeah, just those three. And then I got this LED switch light. Uh, I know I've seen these in quite a few, vi uh, few videos. Of flip it on and off and if you put batteries in it you see it's pretty thick and I guess you adhere it to the wall it's probably going to be with a screw or maybe some adhesive uh, backing on it I have to open it and find out but that's that I just thought that was cute and different and it looks like a light switch so pretty cool I got this uh, stop grinding your teeth uh, little item placard stop grinding uh, it's a hygienic, does this say one day disposable? Oh, so you just use it one time and throw it away. I thought this was something that you keep and use over and over again. For people who grind their teeth. But it says one day disposable. Interesting. Well, I'm going to dispose of it when 
it's no good. <laughs> I feel like I can get at least a week out of it, but it does say one day disposable. Um, but yeah, if you grind your teeth at night, sometimes I grind my teeth when I'm sitting here on the computer editing and I catch myself. So I figured that I would try that and to just try and save the wear and tear on my teeth from the excessive grinding. Um, they put these labels back out and when I first saw these labels, I wanted to get this design and when of course I change my film it record the video post the video up I go back to find um, some of the things after I watch my own video and I'm like I should have got some of those so I did that with these and I was never able to find any until now and that was probably a couple of months ago so I grabbed it and I'm happy so sometimes with this stuff you just have to be patient and it'll come back around. I know a lot of times a lot of the comments on my walkthroughs are we don't get that stuff in our store and sometimes it does eventually come but I've seen a lot of things in a lot of halls on different coasts where I still am waiting to get. So if you feel like your store doesn't get a lot you're not alone just know that because uh, there's a few things that I've seen that I'm like man I really would like to get that and haven't seen them yet um, thank you eight thank you notes it says thanks on the front ice cream cones I love ice cream that is my drug that is my crack and that is why I've gained so much weight because when I'm going through stuff, I go straight for the ice cream. But now I'm about to turn it around, but I had to get this because this is so me. It says thanks on the front and inside the card it says that was totally cool of you. And I don't have a reason to buy these right now, but it's always good to have a cute little thank you card on deck. Now moving on, we're going to go to some spices. This is the herb and garlic marinade. It sounded really good. I cook chicken a lot. I thought this would go really good with chicken or maybe even pork. So I wanted to try this since I haven't seen anybody haul it. And then I do a lot of my seasonings or I get a lot of my seasonings from the Dollar Tree. So I needed some more rosemary leaves. And this was something I haven't tried before. It's Chipotle seasoning. But I got this because I just started playing around with trying to make chicken enchiladas. Um, so I think that's a seasoning that would complement that dish. I got some garlic and pepper salt. And I've had this before and this was a nice big container. And I love garlic salt. I like pepper. And when I'm trying to lose weight and diet and eat right, I do a lot of boiled eggs where I eat the egg whites. And I like to sprinkle that on them and it just, oh my gosh, it tastes so good. So I had to get some more of that. And then they had this Creole seasoning, Creole foods. I've never tried this before. I don't know if I've seen it before. I don't, it felt like it was new, like this was something new that they put out there because it caught my eye the day that I bought it. So I said, oh, that sounds really good. So. It says it makes everything taste great. So if anybody out there has tried this and it's really good, let me know. But I'm obviously going to try it and find out for myself. So let's see what else I got. Last of the food item that I got was this brown rice, whole grain brown rice, 32 ounces or two pounds. And, um, I like brown rice over, well I like white rice but I like to try and eat brown rice when I can because you get more of the fiber than you do in the white rice and less, I think less of the starch. Definitely get more fiber, they say it's a healthier version, plus it tastes good and this is a nice big bag for a dollar. They had three bags there and I got all three. <laughs> So, and that'll last me for a while. I do stretch it out. Um, another calendar here. Now, you know, completely forgot I even bought this one. So, but look at it. It's so festive and fun. It's got that little sticker on it, so I can't open it. I mean, I can, but I won't because I want to open it properly. But 
there's the front there's the back and this oh I got it because it's a two year and this is something that even though we've got the smartphones and all that other electronic stuff all those other electronic gadgets it's still good to have something that doesn't have a power on button and a power off just an old school classic that you can just open up and find out a date when you need to find out a date these containers I thought were really cute this is the pink color that I have in my office so this is my accent color a lot of my containers are in this color and I got this if you saw my walkthrough video you saw that these stack on top of each other like that and this is going to fit perfectly in my office and the way they stack on top of each other I showed in the video these open up right here yeah, they open and then it allows you to stack the other ones on top of each other so I got three of these because I have the perfect space on one of my shelves where I'm going to sit this and use it to keep paperwork and office supplies in. Um, this is, this next thing was a couponing item that I got. These next two things. Let me just show them both at the same time. Couponing freebies. Uh, the Band-Aid, the Curate, Curate Band-Aid, there's 10 in this box, and then there are small gauze pads, and how many does it there's 10 in this box. So each of these were free, and for you guys who know me from my couponing days, I had a grip of coupons, so I got a whole basket full of these. I think I showed you the basket before, but these are also... Uh, uh, item that I purchased so I've got this big basket full of all I think it's about I can't even remember now maybe 24 25 of these and then these are the gauze ones another basket and I don't have as many of the gauze ones because I use all my coupons I got more of the band-aids than anything I can't see when I put this up there and this is what the coupon looks like just FYI it expired July 31st, um, but this is what the coupon looked like. It was a dollar off of any, I'm so small, off of any one Curat bandage gauze or tape product. So I saved that to show you guys, so I could have got one more <laughs> as though I really needed it. But that's what this, um, these two baskets are. It's full of the gauze bandages and the gauze pads moving right along okay we are in the home stretch with this haul the last few items i bought for children not children in my life but i work from home and oftentimes customers will come and they'll bring their kids with them and their kids sometimes are unruly they want to run around and mess with stuff so i needed to buy a couple of items to keep them busy so i saw these little dolls what do they call it magnet dress up kit so you get the doll and you get a couple of outfits and like a, a little prop and you can just use the magnet and dress her up and change your outfit so they had this one and they had this one so it looked like a caucasian a black chick and a Hispanic chick that's how I see them <laughs> and then you can look on the back here and it shows you like the different ideas of the different outfits that you can dress them up in so I wanted to have a container in my office that had some toys that these kids can play with because parents act like they don't know how to control their child I'm like uh, excuse me but they can't run around here and blah 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 and the kids acting crazy and I'm like you can't be messing up my stuff now this is how I make my living so I figured I'd get some items to uh, keep these kids entertained so they can go somewhere sit down and be quiet and let me do what I gotta do um, the, I also got these little what is this called again spinios spinios and these are neat this would entertain any child if you look on the back um, it has like that little hypnotic <laughs> twirling thing 
maybe you can hit them to tie some of these kids and calm them down. And then on the front, they have little animals. Uh, what is this, a horse and a rabbit? But, oh, and then I got this one. I actually got three of them. This one is some couple of monster looking things. And clearly this is a magnet that makes it stay on this thing. But what I didn't realize when I bought it, I thought this was like a yo-yo where they can just sit and hold it and the yo-yo would just keep going around back and forth, around back and forth and never fall off. But I opened one because I bought three as I said. This was the third one that I bought. And this has looks like a dragon or a frog or something and then on the back side is this and this is the other piece which looks like some other kind of dragon but this was the third one that I purchased and I was trying to you know make the thing move but it falls off probably just broke <laughs> but it falls off and this is my point hold on let me get this thing okay so it falls off and then when I looked at the package if you hold your hand kind of like this to prevent it when it's moving it kind of will stay on but then it's kind of boring but it might entertain a kid I opened this one so I'll keep it but I may take the other two back because when I looked at the package this connects to another it's kind of like when you buy a race car track and you're adding pieces to it you see this little thing right here this is like a whole little structure and these are pieces that you can pop onto that structure and I guess they all move around and it stays on or something so I didn't realize that when I bought it that it was a part of a structure so because I opened this one I'll keep it but I might take the other two back and exchange them for a normal toy but the other one that I got was this robot defender just something to entertain a little boy it looks like all the pieces break off and then you can stick them back together so I got that and then I got this pack of four turbo wheels four little cars so these are nothing special but that just is what I got so I just wanted to add it to my haul and these didn't come from the Dollar Tree. These came from Happy Meals. But I'm like, you know what? If you're going to throw those away, let me just throw them in my toy bin. So when these kids come with their with my customers, they have something to keep busy. It didn't cost me a lot of money. And I don't have to worry about them running around my office potentially breaking something. And then I'll be pissed. So that is my Dollar Tree haul for the last... Uh, how many weeks? That's probably been about at least three or four weeks worth of stuff. And this week was the biggest purchase that I did today. And that's the stuff that I started out with because I think I just went into withdrawals. I, I've been good for so long. I had to break out <laughs> and buy something. So I hope you guys enjoyed the haul. If you like my video, then go ahead and click that like button. Give me a thumbs up, not the like button. If you like my video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe for more. And if you don't know, I do weekly Dollar Tree walkthroughs. I try to put them, well, I walk through every Friday and I try to post them by Saturday, Sunday. Sometimes it might happen on a Monday because I get really busy. There's so many things that I'm trying to juggle I'm trying to stay consistent with when I post them so it's normally Saturday or Sunday but every once in a blue moon it'll be on a Monday but just rest assured I put it out every week I can't commit to saying exactly when because I don't like to say something and not do it but for you guys who have been watching them you have seen I have been regular and I appreciate your support I'm glad you guys are enjoying the videos and I'm trying to make them a little bit more interesting and creative. And for the people who tell me, again, um, you don't like the music on the videos, or I wish you would talk, or, you know, as far as the music is concerned, a suggestion is just to mute the video when you watch it, and you don't have to hear the music. I'm not going to talk through them because it's just too much. I have to do um, a voiceover and get, it's just, I'm not going to do all of that. The whole point is just to show you 
what's out there kind of like how you're shopping in the store and you don't have to hear anybody's excessive chatting like I'm doing right now so on that note I'm going to shut up I'm going to stop this video I'm going to wish you all a great evening morning noon or night whenever you're watching this video and I'll see you in the next one